Hello everybody, this is Frank from F-Files and we are doing another episode of Wo Long Fallen Dynasty. Um, if you have watched my previous videos, I have covered this entire area from front to back. Uh, every hidden item, every, every flag, it's all taken care of. As you can see at the top screen here. It's a little, I don't know why I keep blurring out my head about that. But, um, yeah, so, um, all of it's covered. Um, and then you open these doors, and then there's more doors, which are boss doors. Now, this is the famous Lubu, and, um, you know, I've seen some things online about him. He is extremely hard. To fight, I've fought him a couple times already, so I will tell you a couple things. First off, you can consume your consumables before you enter the door and they'll be on. So that's a good idea because this guy gets straight into the fucking battle. When, as soon as you get into the fight, he's going to shoot you with an arrow. 90% of the time he does the same exact thing. He's going to shoot you with an arrow and then he's going to hit you with a critical blow. So you want to get ready to deflect both of those right away. If you don't, it's going to start out pretty bad. But, you know, you could recover from it. Um, another note, I've pretty much used the five-colored cudgel the whole, uh, the whole game, and I've done very well with it, with bosses and everything. This boss in particular, though, no. I can't get a martial arts off on him. He's too quick, he's mobile, he's on his horse running around like a maniac, shooting you with arrows. And then even when he's on foot, he's jumping around like an asshole. Um, I've noticed too, you know, when you summon your uh, your little NPC buddies, um, his health bar does not go down. No, I mean, you can just hit him and hit him and hit him. So I'm guessing it's like Souls, other the other Souls games when you summon and uh, you know people to help you that the boss has a bit more HP. Um, so I found it easier to fight him alone, and I actually almost beat him off. I beat him off screen, but I just chose to die because I want wanted to. I didn't realize I wasn't recording, and then I did. And I was like, "Fuck! I have to record this fight for you guys." So, um, here we go. I got my uh, morale. Make sure you get your morale up to 25. As you can see there, my morale's 25. Um, if you don't have elixir to pop to get it up, then you're going to have to get run around and fuck up everything. You know, fight the NPCs in the area, get some kill uh, killing blows on them until your spirit or until your morale is back to 25. And every time you lose, your morale goes down to 20. This makes a huge difference in the fight. It really does. It, um, like, it's pretty imperative. It kind of sucks that you have to go back and fight. I mean, I've literally fought these mobs tw like uh, at least 10 times just to get my morale back up. It's almost like muscle memory now. Um, so without for I'm done blabbing about it. Let's get right into it because I'm ready to beat this fucking guy. Alright, so, uh, pretty much all of my consumables I've used, a lot of them, um, but you can keep buying them, some of them at the thing. I use Bear Gall for spirit sustainability, I pop that, and make sure you pop, uh, you go, you put your hot bar back on your potion, though. And then, of course, look, I already fucking up.
Switching back to the sword now. This is what I should have been using. Wow, okay, that was supposed to stun him. close I was to. Now I gotta fucking grind morale back. Uh, I'm gonna try to do it without it, without grinding morale. <sighs> what the hell? Do you see that shit? Good God. Enough already with this guy. I <laughs> uh, got what I asked for. I've been waiting for him. Here he is.
me over. What? What? Oh, shit. I can't believe that. Oh, God. See how much of a difference the morale makes? I, I, I like, would have done so much more damage if it was 25. Dude. Let's go. Uh, already bad start. Oh, there's a second phase. There's a second phase. All elixir has been sent to Maywoo Fort. Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god, he runs away like a bitch. Wow. So that's not the end of him, huh? Come on, get him. Surely not. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That was a fucking tough fight. Whew, it took me longer than I'd like to admit. Very tough. I only got rank 4 leather for that. Where's the rank 5 leather at? That was a fucking tough boy. Maybe these dong, the dong zoo. I have the dong zoo armor and a heavy cavalry spell. Like you'd think, he, like this would have dropped something nice. Maybe the, the heavy cavalry spear is nice. I don't know, but it's only rank one. Or, or uh, it doesn't look like I got much good shit out of this. Damn. Fucking hard ass fight, shitty rewards. God, I'm glad it's over though. Fucking Lou Boo, everybody. The internet says he's one of the hard ones, or actually, they say he's the hardest, but besides the last boss, apparently, I don't know. Maybe he's harder, maybe he's not. We'll find out. God damn. He did run away, so we're probably he's probably gonna be around again. Of course he fucking runs away. Okay, this loading screen is taking forever. Alrighty. Ready for a whole movie of fucking cutscenes, everybody? Withdrawn to Meiwu Fort. Our capital of 200 years. My men and I are going after Dong Zhou, even if it's only us. You'll have to count me out on this one. Something urgent has come up. Wait a moment! Some of us must stay and help the people! Please, allow Jen to ask the same, my lord. The only one who can set this situation right. Me, motherfucker. Is you, my warrior. Emo chick to the rescue, baby. Emo monk, babe. <laughs> okay, Lu Yang. AD 190, this is the new play, well, the new stage, I mean, yeah, new stage, cool. Alright guys, everybody, that's Lu, Lu Bu, uh, the first fight anyway with him. Um, thanks for watching, please like and subscribe if it helped you at all, fight him, or if you just enjoyed watching. Oh look, some lightning, this place looks cool, cool new area. Alright. So, this is for next video, guys. Alright. Um, oh, you know what? Let's hit the dialogue up while we're at it. I can't believe this. This place was the picture of prosperity when I last came. The elixir Jonggong had. Did it end up being used for this? We may encounter the Taoist that was riding the dragon. We need to be really careful. We may encounter the Taoist. We need okay. to be really careful. Well, that's hers. And he's just following us as an NPC. Fuck him. Uh, there's the battle flag. And then let's see what we unlocked here. New battlefield available. Um, this is this is part of part four. And then there's a sub battlefield we unlocked. Cool.
All right, guys. For uh, stay tuned for the next part of uh, Wo Long Fallen Dynasty. Lu Bu is down, and we are to continue on onward and upward. F files out. Please hit a subscribe button for a brother. All right. Enjoy your night, everybody.